I am out here recording right now and uh, I'm also editing videos right here. I'm posting a video right now. You guys are going to see this in a couple or yesterday. No, no, not yesterday. Two days ago. This video is going to be posted two days from now. Um, but yeah, I'm like getting ahead on all my vlogging and stuff like that. Um, yeah, my room is a mess. Look at this. Yeah, I got plates. I got clothes. I got everything in here. It's all messed up. Okay, the video is done processing. I always get so excited whenever the video uploads. Because like the process... Oh, it uploads! Yeah! And I'll be wearing these glasses. If you're wondering why they're yellow, it's because it is like computer glasses. So when I'm wearing them for a long period of time, it protects my eyes from the rays that are bad that I give off from the laptop screen or the phone screen. So I use them when I'm playing on my phone or my laptop for a long time because I play a lot of video games on my laptop. And yeah, so it just, it just helps protect that from long-term damage from my eyes. And so I don't go blind like my brothers. Okay, so I just got off of work. Uh, I'm really tired. I'm, I'm waiting here because my mom needs to pick me up. And no, I do not drive yet. I got my permit, but I need to get my driving school underway. And then I will be able to drive finally. After I wait to be legal to drive, of course. But yeah, uh, I'll see you guys when I get home. I'm gonna make another video. You don't listen, you little rascal. She looks like a little cute rat. Look at her. That's the noise she makes. No, I was joking. She doesn't make the noise. She's a cute little chihuahua. Okay, so my mom picked me up and she was like, hey, why don't you go walk the dog too? And I'm like, huh, I'm tired. I just got back from work. And freaking my dog is like on drugs. She's been sniffing this for like 15 minutes. <gasps> she fin finished. Oh my god, Bella. Jesus Christ, strobe light. Alright, so I never showed you guys my chickens. My little cocks. Um, so we're gonna go right here and show you guys them. Yeah, they're all piled in there. We have 11 of them, and ever since we've had them, you stay in there. Ever since we've had them, we have we have not uh, paid for or bought eggs since. And yeah, so I'm using this uh, blackhead remover thing again because it actually seems to work a little bit. So I'm using it to see if it's going to help out in the next couple of days, and then we'll see what happens. But yeah. Sorry if my hair is all messed up, I just took a shower, but my hair is long, so that's what happens, and yeah. Okay guys, so I'm going to be putting this at the end of my video, and um, I've been wanting to do this for a while. This is uh, pretty serious, I always make it fun in games and stuff like that, but some people need this stuff, and I'm going to help you guys with this. Uh, people, they tell me that they need motivation to get into the gym. Or motivation is to be positive or not feel bad about themselves. Uh, I want to start out with um, a couple statements uh, from at least some famous actors, um, all these people that have created motivational speeches, including Arnold uh, Schwarzenegger, because he is like my inspiration. And uh, so we're going to start out with him. And with his speech that I always have in my head, and that is any reason that you can have to get into the gym is a good reason. You can get into the gym by wanting to look good for girls. You can get into the gym just by uh, making you look better than the bully that you're getting bullied by. You can get into the gym by just wanting to get bigger like me, or wanting to get more ripped, or wanting to... Just get the girls, which is what a lot of guys want to do. But they don't want to work for it. You can do all that stuff, but you still got to work for what you want. You can't just go to the gym and be like, oh, the next day I'm going to be so ripped. I can't. No. You go there. If you work your butt off, the next day you're not going to look 
you're not going to look exactly the same, but you're not going to look significantly different. That's why you got to work day in, day out, day in, day out for months, and then one day you'll get that body that you want. No questions asked. People will not take that body from you if you keep working for it because it's yours, you put the work in for it, and it's not anyone else's to take. Nobody can come up and be like, dude, bro, I, you did all that work. I'm going to take this body from you, bro. They're not going to do that. I promise you they're not. So part two of this is if you want something, go and get it. Period. I don't know the movie that it's from. I have seen it in a bunch of motivational videos. It's with Will Smith. That's all I know. He That's his quote from the movie. But that is one of the most importantly true quotes of all time. If you want something, go get it. Period. That's all you need in your head. And one day you'll get what you want. And what you're striving for no matter what. And now I want to... Uh, be able to tell you guys what I what motivates me what motivates me is when I started going to the gym it was the thing with the bullying problem I was being bullied for having a big nose for looking Russian for looking skinny um, I was a kicker for my football team and everybody would bully me because I was only the kicker and I was skinny so I didn't want to play anything else because I knew that something bad would happen to me. Um, freshman year, that's when I realized that kicking was like my dream and my, what I would want to do for, with my life. I wanted to be an NFL kicker. I still practice every once in a while, but it's not my number one dream anymore. I still strive for it because I'm going to play college ball next year. Yeah, so sophomore year came around. I got into bodybuilding. When my brother came back from the army and everybody was like, bro, you grew. And I was like, yeah, I know. I'm working out every day. I'm like, I'm drinking protein and stuff like that. And when I tell them that, they're like, bro, you do that voluntarily? And I'm like, yeah. They do that only mandatory for their football. Other than that, they're partying. They're having sex with girls. It's like, that's not the number one thing in the world. It's like, the number one thing in the world is to make you feel good. Make your body feel good and make your body happy. Because later on in life, all that parting is going to catch up to you. And you're going to have a failed liver when you're like 60. That's not healthy. So that's why, if you want to stay motivated, that's a reason. And to eat right, it'll make your body happy. You'll feel good. You won't be sick as often and you'll be healthier, happier, and you feel better than everybody else. Because at the end of the day, but it's what you like gave to get what you have. All right, guys. So I hope you like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Comment. Um, if you guys are having problems, uh, comment in the comment section and I will reply to everyone's comments. No matter how many there are, one day I'll finish all of them, I promise. And I will help you stay motivated. If you have a problem, I will even make a video and I will help you step by step. I'll leave my email in the description. I'll leave my uh, Instagram in the description. You can DM me. I do not have Twitter. Um, but if you DM me on Instagram or email me, I will give you more of my information and we can contact each other easier on there. I will help step by step on how to get motivated, stay motivated, and get to where you want to be. Obviously, I'm not at my dream I'm not at my dream body yet, but I want to help people on my journey on the way to my to my perfect body. There's no such thing as being perfect, but when you imagine it, it's a really good feeling thinking about you getting to that perfect body. So if you guys like the video, please like, comment again. Don't forget to comment in the comment section. Subscribe for more videos. I'll make these every Monday, Motivational Monday videos. And I will see you all later.